Heavy rain greeted the field at the McDonald's Spey Valley Golf Club on Sunday for the final day of the Scottish Hydro Challenge. Having shot a spectacular 62 on Saturday, rankings leader Brooks Koepka continued to set the pace. This birdie on the par 4 first, teeing up a fascinating day's play. On a day beset by weather-related delays, local favourite Duncan Stewart secured his best challenge tour finish with a tie for sixth. Birdie here on the 18th, handing him the Douglas Lowe Memorial Trophy for the highest place Scott. With the rain continuing to blight the day's play, Italy's Andrea Pavan did well to even see the hole on 14. A great putt for his second birdie of the day. A final day 71 saw him finish in the group tied for second. Alongside Stephen Tiley, who recorded his best finish of the year. The Englishman carding a final round 72 and a 16,000 euro payday. It was also a season's best finish for former US amateur champion Byung Hun An. Having smashed the course record on day one, the Korean continued to shine amongst the Spey Valley gloom. Rounding off the group on 15 under, last year's Scottish Hydro champion Sam Walker. The two-time winner of the event at home on the Aviemore fairways, as this birdie on the seventh shows. But out in front, the unstoppable Kopka was on the march to the winner's podium once more. This approach to the final green, underlining the Americans' class in all conditions this season. In true style, he finished it off with a birdie, thus securing his third Challenge Tour win this season and automatic promotion to the European Tour. Mission accomplished for the easy-going Floridian. Uh, it was brutal today, um, you know, with the rain, the wind, everything. It was a combination of everything, but uh, you just got to stick it out and gut it out and know that everybody's got to play in it, and uh, it worked out today.